In this video, we're going to be looking at moving a person up the bed with two slide sheets and a two-person assist. Now, the reason why we might adopt this is that our, our client is unable to bend or at least hold their knees in that bent position. If they can't do this, it would mean that a single folded sheet under their body would cause their heels to be dragged along the bed. And obviously, we want to avoid this. So for this particular client type, two full-size sheets is the best option. So let's have a look at the setup or preparation for this particular procedure. As always, we're going to need to make sure that we have our work environment set up safely. This is going to include having bed breaks on, making sure that our bed is at the correct height for both operators, and making sure that our work environment is nice and clear of obstructions. We need to make sure that we've discussed this procedure with our client to make sure that they're able to assist or at least be aware of what we're going to do here. And finally, we need to make sure that we have the correct equipment. For this particular procedure, the correct equipment is two full-size slide sheets, and those slide sheets need to be large enough to span the client's feet to their head, and a little bit extra, ideally. Okay, so let's have a look at the entire procedure before moving to a step-by-step -step breakdown. Okay, now let's have a look at a step-by-step -step breakdown of this particular procedure. We're going to start by rolling the person onto their side using correct rolling technique. Now for this particular procedure, it is ideal of course to bend the client's opposite knee, but because we're doing this particular procedure on a client who is unable to bend or hold their knees, it is quite likely that they won't be able to bend their knees. So we may have to just be happy with crossing their legs over. We're going to have their arm across their chest and have them looking in the direction of the roll. Once we get the person onto their side, then we make sure that we have our two slide sheets together. We gather up some of that slide sheet and push it under the person's hips and shoulders. We want at least a third, but ideally up to about a half of this sheet going underneath the person. And this is the time to make sure that we have our correct height. So we have the, the sheet spanning all the way from their head to their feet so that when we roll them back they're going to be nicely on that sheet. We'll then roll them back onto the sheet and take the sheet out from the other side. Sometimes you need to roll them a bit to get that sheet. If you've tucked it under very well probably you don't need to roll them very much to retrieve that sheet. So now our client should be completely on both sheets and the sheets should completely span their feet to their head. They're ready to slide. And the first technique that we can do to slide them up is standing at the head of the bed. So both carers or operators will stand at the head of the bed and be facing the client's shoulders. We're going to get ourselves into a nice lunge position and we're going to grasp the top sheet in close to the client's shoulder. Then, in a coordinated fashion, we're going to make sure that we lunge and pull back towards ourselves. We're not pulling to the head of the bed, we're pulling into ourselves. And what that will do is 
when both workers do it together, the forces will be nicely balanced and the client will move straight up the bed. It's a nice safety feature to have a pillow at the head of the bed here, just to make sure the client doesn't hit their head on the way up. The alternate method is um, standing from beside, and you would adopt this if you were not able to get to the head of the bed. For instance, a person may have um, a bedside table that's unable to be moved, or other obstructions that are permanently placed at the head of the bed, and you just can't get to that location. In this situation, we're going to both stand beside the person around about the height of the sort of between the hips and shoulders, a little bit closer to the shoulders. We're going to grasp the sheet in nice and close at the hips and shoulders and just gently pull away from each other to ensure the sheet is nice and tight. Then, in a coordinated fashion, we will simply lunge from one foot to the other and slide the person up the bed. It's really important that we avoid twisting in this particular procedure. Because we are moving side to side, there is the potential or the possibility for twisting. We can make sure that we don't do this if we stand with a nice wide stance and we simply lunge or shift our weight from one foot to the other. And of course, we've got to do it in a nice coordinated fashion. Once the person is up the bed, we need to obviously remove that sheet. And the best way to do this is by rolling them in one direction, tucking the sheet under, and then rolling them back and removing that sheet. This is the same for removing a single slide sheet or even removing a hoist sling. It's a pretty standard technique. Some extra options that you can take for this particular procedure are putting some bed tilt, some head down bed tilt. This will make it a little easier to slide the person up the bed and would be really useful for a larger client. So let's have a look at the main takeaways for moving a person up the bed with two slide sheets and a two person assist. Firstly, we're going to have our work environment set up safely with correct bed height, brakes are on, and no obstructions. We're going to make sure we discuss this procedure with our client so they may be able to assist or be aware of what's happening. Thirdly, we will roll the person onto their side um, using correct rolling technique and tuck that sheet underneath. A good third to a half of the sheets go underneath. Roll them back and then retrieve the sheet. Fourth, we're going to position ourselves in a safe position to move the person up the bed. And this can be a front to back lunge from the head of the bed or a side to side lunge from the side of the bed. Lastly, once we get the person up the bed, we're going to roll the person onto their side to remove that slide sheet. So that was our video on sliding a person up the bed using two slide sheets and a two person assist.